Hi there, Paul Ohashi here again, and this time I'm going to talk to you about Big Brother's flash display. The flash display you're looking at shows a world clock view here at the top that can be configured to display the time from different cities around the world. I've got a couple of device groupings over here, a control panel down here, and a ticker down at the bottom of the browser. Big Brother's Modern looking flash display gives you a single pane of glass because it allows you to import monitored devices from multiple Big Brother management servers into the same browser. And you can do this by entering a URL to a remote Big Brother management server into this text field here at the top and then clicking on the green text below. When you do that, a color coded control panel for that remote management server pops into the browser which can be moved anywhere on the display. You set up the main display or the look and feel of the main display by clicking on the systems icon which launches a view or window of device groupings and from there you can click on any of those device groupings to see the test results for any of the monitored devices in those particular groupings. You can mouse over any of these status icons in any of these device groupings that are in a distressed state, anything that's other than green, to get a truncated report for that particular device and test. Or you can click on any of these icons to get the full report for that device and test. And all of the status reports are similar. They'll show you the name of the device and the name of the test at the top of the report. The status color and timestamp the report was last generated. Output of the report information on how long the status has been unchanged and where the report was received from. Each of these flash reports has this history button and if you click on the history button a window or a view similar to this pops up which shows you up to the last 25 changes in status and the duration of each of those changes for that particular device and test. Big Brother now has native graphing and trending for many of the out-of-the-box tests like CPU, disk space, memory, and the network service tests as well. And you can specify a date range over here to get a custom chart. Or you can select from any of the predefined time periods down here to generate a report, a graphical trending report for that particular time period. So here we're looking at the uh, CPU for the past year. The summary icon in the control panel launches a window or a view similar to this. This is a condensed view of everything that's going on in Big Brother. This view will only show you the monitored devices that have failed certain tests or are in an undesirable state. Any device that's green across the board will not appear in this window. And you can mouse over any of these status icons to get a truncated report or you can click on them to get the full blown report as well. The Recents icon in the control panel, if you click on that, it launches a window or a view similar to this. It shows you the most recent events. This is a dynamic view. It'll show you up to the last 25 changes in status detected by that management server. So it, it is dynamic as cha new changes in status occur. Old changes in status will be pushed out. And you can mouse over and click on any of these status icons in the left column to see the previous report for that device and test or any of the icons in the right column to see the current report for that particular device and test. Well, that's about it for the features and the functionality of the flash display. I look forward to speaking with you again in other video modules about Big Brother. Thanks for joining.